are set to go. Our next bout, it's the rematch. 12 rounds, and this is the final eliminator for the WBC Lightweight Championship. Introducing first to the stage, professional record, 40 wins, four defeats, one draw, one no contest. He has 19 knockouts. He fights out of Paris, Paris, France. He's the former IBF Intercontinental, WBC Intercontinental. He's the European Union and French Lightweight Champion, and he is the current WBC Silver Titleist. Please welcome Yvonne. The Lion Mendy. I love it. You're such a funky boy. I love it. With this music, man. This music be killing me. Anyway, I'm excited for this. Um, I learned yesterday that a lot of people think that uh, Luke Campbell is going to lose to Yvonne Mendy again in his second fight. Luke Campbell. He's lost two fights, um, most notable against um, Yvonne Mendy. It was an upset at the time. Um, the fight was on a uh, late notice. He said he didn't watch any. Why is this just too big? He said he didn't um, watch any footage on um, Yvonne Mendy beforehand. But looking at Yvonne Mendy since the Luke Campbell fight, if I'm correct, there's been seven fights since then. He's gotten a lot better, especially since the earlier losses in his career to guys like uh victor postal which and um this guy right here i saw him fight he's um he's back in the rankings again i don't know why i was so hyped right there hey, let me get rid of this um oh wait what are we doing i'm a sick folk i like the quick folk I'm they're gonna get me they're gonna get my videos taken down with this music they are tripping why would they do this whatever you know you got just the cost to be the boss i guess it's the cost to be the boss but anyway let's go back so it's been one two three four five six no, it's been like nine fights, seven, eight, nine, ten fights since he fought Luke Campbell. That's a lot of experience. Let's get him on the scales. Ryan Mendy. <laughs> Crazy. Nine stone. Eight pounds, seven ounces, nine, eight, seven, nine stone, eight pounds, seven ounces for Yvonne. And he hasn't just been winning. He's been like winning by like shutouts, knockouts, and looking in the best shape of his career. Remember, the winner of this goes on to fight Mikey Garcia if Mikey Garcia still keeps the belt. It's fucking music. Six ounces for Cool Hand Luke. Both 134.7. We're going to see tomorrow, though. This is the card right here, by the way. It's um, obviously going to be Anthony Joshua versus Pavekin, and this is the, the, the chief support of the undercard. Um, it's not a co-feature. You know, it's the chief support, you know, of the undercard. Luke Campbell versus Javon Mendy. The winner goes on to be the WBC 135-pound uh, uh, mandatory if Mikey Garcia keeps that belt. Mikey Garcia has until September the 25th to decide if he's going to fight Richard Comey to defend his IBF title or he'll have to vacate. And if he does vacate, then likely he'll vacate that WBC too. Unless the WBC, which will they will likely do, elevate him to a emeritus, emeritus champion. And whenever he decides he wants to come back down to 135 after Earl Spence, if that does happen, then he'll be the mandatory again still. So, um, right now, there's a lot riding on this fight. Also, you have uh, Matty Askin versus Lawrence O'Cauley for the British title. Sergey Kuzman versus uh, Masochist Price. And then the other cards, they're on the uh, free uh, view. So, nonetheless, we're going to be covering the card. We're going to be um, covering the fight. Um, it's hard to go against uh, Yvonne Mindy, especially since he already beat Luke Campbell once. Look at that stare down. Like, in my opinion, this, I'm very excited for this fight. I know nobody's really talking about it, but sometimes it's the fights like this in, in the, the, the acquired taste. I'm going to enjoy it. Oh, wait, are they going to interview Luke Campbell? I like this new thing off the scales. 
I haven't been happy with the um the coverage from um the zone on um we'll see tomorrow. We'll see tomorrow. It's still too early. It's still too early. Anyway, I'm Teacher Controversy. This is Teacher Controversy Live. Please subscribe.